drawn to what hurts us. <laughs> I read about that somewhere. Like drawn to sugar when we know it messes with our bodies. Like getting pissed up, smoking way too much. Well, it's a few years ago now when Friends Reunited popped up and I thought, well, given I had a shit time at school, why not look up some of those school bullies? I wish I could say it was either a mistake or a great thing. To an outsider, it would seem utter madness. But after years having elapsed, I needed to know that this dull pain I had still was linked to some people and not just in my imagination. I put myself on there and started to look round for the years I was at school to see who was on. I found an old girlfriend, now married and a receptionist at a dentist's. I found an old bum chum too, although he soon told me to sling my hook. He too was married now, did not want his gay past brought up again, like I would cause any trouble to anyone. If there's anything being bullied taught me, that it's not worth seeking revenge. Or is it four years of counselling that gave me that revelation? <laughs> My life was hell back then. I lived in a state of permanent fear and anger all mixed up together. I never knew where the next slap thumb of verbal abuse would come from. This was a place I had to go to. If I had played truant, then the whole punishment would be dreadful. It was a perfect trap, and there was no one to tell about it. My dad's response was, fight back. Not a good idea if you're not a fighter by personality. Anyway, back to Friends Reunited. I did say hello to a few of the perpetrators, but they were all sweetness and light, like nothing happened, right? Right. Only John apologised for terrorising me, which was kind of okay, but we still didn't have anything in common. In all, it was a disappointing exercise. <laughs> But I did take comfort in just how boring some people's lives had become. Weighed down by families, keeping them in place. I have taken control of my life and I'm happy. It took years though. And those are times I will never get back. Though, heaven knows, I try.